Hi, I'm David Council from Inferno Marketing and Design, and this is another email update. In a moment, I'm going to talk to you about using social media to promote your business to specific people. Before I do that, let me ask you, do you know someone who could use our help at Inferno Marketing and Design with their advertising? If you do, then perhaps you could give us their details or just put them in touch with us. After all, who wouldn't want to help a friend out when it comes to their advertising and marketing? It can be pretty confusing. Now, if you do send us through a referral, I'll happily send you a thank you in the way of a, a bottle of wine. And you never know, that friend of yours could end up as a client of ours or just getting their marketing back into gear. Right, let's talk about uh, using social media to target specific people. Now, a lot of people think when it comes to social media that they've got to talk to everybody. After all, it's a media, just like radio or television. But that's not the case. Some social media actually works better with different types of people. Take Pinterest, for example. Pinterest is an absolute powerhouse when it comes to talking to women. Facebook is good for talking to all people. However, there's no rule that says that you've got to talk to all people. You may decide with your Facebook page, for example, to talk to just women or just men. It is such an easy way to target a specific customer group. So don't feel that you have to have a Facebook page, for example, that only talks to everybody. Just like in everything that you do with your business, you can use it to laser target specific people. One of the first things you've got to do when it comes to using social media in this way is think like your customer. So instead of being general, you need to target in that particular group. So if you're a mechanics, for example, and you'd like to target women, then think about the issues that women have when it comes to getting their car serviced and repaired and put messages up on your social media that will help them out specifically. Number two, another thing that you can do is actually put photos up on social media. After all, everyone likes five minutes of fame and it's a great way to get people to share those photos out with their friends. And if you do post pictures onto your Facebook page, then tag the people in. It's really important that they know that you've posted it up there. So make sure you get pictures of people as they come to, into your business and then tag them into that photo. If you're running a business, then you're in a community. So it makes sense to look at things that are happening in your community and post about them on your Facebook page. But then think about who your target is. What are the things that that customer that you're targeting specifically is going to be interested in and look for those. So for example, once again, if you're running a mechanics firm and you're trying to target women, uh, perhaps you could target in local soccer teams. So whenever the local soccer teams, you know, the under sixes, the under eights are playing, then put up um, information about their roster. Uh, if they've got kids playing in the league, get them to post pictures of their kids celebrating their victory, that sort of thing. After all, you want that community involvement and you want them to be interacting with your social media and your business. So they're just a couple of things that you can do to target specific people for your business using social media. If you'd like to know more about how you can use social media to talk to your customers and encourage them to become repeat customers, then give us a call at Inferno Marketing and Design. We'd love to have a chat with you and give you some ideas about what is possible. Until next time, I'm David Council. I look forward to talking to you then.